All right, Miss Olivia is here. A recipe that we really didn't understand, uh, uh, really oui. at first. Oui. Um, but we thought, hey, she oui. knows what she's doing. Um, it's a great idea to bring her in and explain. <laughs> All I did was read the teleprompter. Yeah, I don't know anything about we. I didn't know what you're so, making. It was really Beth that didn't understand. I, I get it. Um, let's talk about what you're doing. <laughs> I'm making breadcrumbs. Perfect. How do you how do you do this? These are my homemade breadcrumbs, and okay. I did them in the food processor. All right. And that's the beginning of a breadcrumb topping for just about anything you'd like to put it on. Casseroles, mm -hmm. uh, top it, um, baked chicken, and we're going to start with the breadcrumbs. Okay. okay. This is fresh parsley, finely minced. Back up just a second. What's your favorite type of bread to use for the crumbs? Just like a French roll, just a day-old bread? What, what's your preference? My own homemade. Well, I know that, but if people don't have your own homemade, what? Oh, um, depends on what you're going to put it on. If okay. you want it to be slightly sweet, then use the Hawaiian rolls. Oh, those are good. Yes, they're wonderful. Okay. And nice I, and thick. I cannot improve on them, so I don't okay. make them. Okay, okay, that's good to know. I was just curious. That's a good one for the sweet ones. Uh, anything that is uh, a whole grain bread is a good thing. Mm -hmm. That's fresh parsley. You like that? No, Did I no. have something else in it? That's all right. <laughs> it's quality control. No, it's just a little wrapper. Oh, well. Hmm. I didn't want to get stuck in Beth's teeth. Thank you. Well, you're just a good boy. Thank you. What else we got over here? And I then, derailed you, Miss Olivia. I'm that's sorry, okay. but I appreciate Honey, that. I stayed derailed. <laughs> <laughs> I'd make a freight train take a dirt road. <laughs> this is onion about that and garlic. Okay. And it's very <laughs> finely minced. And you can use whatever cheese you want to. Yeah. I like Parmesan, so this is okay. what's in here. You can also put all of this, your bread, torn up bread, mm -hmm. everything in the food processor and pulse it until you get the consistency you'd like. I like cheese, so I just put this through the salad shooter. Through the what? Salad shooter. <laughs> now, you can also add your favorite herbs, uh, anything that you want to do to put on your casserole, or as I said, on um, chicken breast. That I know it you're sounds good make. on chicken breast, yeah. Yes, uh, I might drizzle just a little bit of butter on it so it'll stick together better. Okay. This is like the uh, white lines in the parking lot. Mm. There is no rules, they're just suggestions. You know who likes a good breadcrumb? Who? Chief Meteorologist Todd. Todd Howell. <laughs> well, okay. he likes him a good, if he were only around, he likes him a good breadcrumb. Hey, well, darling, can find I'll tell you. Oh, hey, hey, what's going on? on? No, I'm sorry. How are you? I do love breadcrumbs. Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, help yourself, son. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, just dig in there and eat your Have some. Have a big old bite. <laughs> this is Olivia's some. Table, located 1108 West Broadway <laughs> Avenue in Maryville. No, well, coming up next, we're going to tell peach. you about the local because woman who will appear time. on tonight. Going to appear well, tonight, excuse me, on one of the country's <laughs> top game shows. We're all good here. They're going to chat it out as we go to break. Let's check in with Ed Ruff and a check of traffic. No, 